package for Johnny Test. What is it? I don't know. Who's it from? I don't know. Well, what do you know? That I have a lot more deliveries to make today. So goodbye. He's rude. Agreed. But open pretty package. Did you get a package? Who's it from? The suspense is killing us! Okay, we have got to get out more as a family. Open it! <gasps> Congratulations, Johnny! You've won a five-day family cruise on the behemoth of the seas! We're getting out more as a family! A ship 20 stories tall with state-of-the-art pool, giant spa, skateboard park, handsome teen towel boys, and the scrumptious Meatloaf Museum. No! <laughs> You know, your father and I have always wanted to take a vacation without you kids. Huh? Ooh, did I say that last part out loud? Yeah. But since you kids can't get lost on a ship, we can pretend we don't have any. Works for us. Get packing, Test Family, because your dream vacation starts now. To the suitcases. <laughs> remember entering any cruise contest. And you think it sounds fishy. <laughs> Get it? Ocean, cruise, fishy. Who cares? It's free cruise time, baby! Now remember, we love you very much. And we're just pretending we don't have kids until we meet up for dinner later. Bye! And we're pretending we don't have parents. And I'm pretending I didn't bring my dog. Now, it says here the ship has a ski jump, a nine-hole golf course, and a make-your-own duck factory. What do you want to do first? I want to figure out how I won this trip when I didn't enter any contest. Skateboard park it is! <laughs> the spa? I thought we were tangoing to see the meatloaf museum. There's plenty of time for that. Now is the time to relax. You're right. We'll take the deep tissue massage. And we don't have any kids. <laughs> <laughs> now, before we pool it, we agree to not like the same guy. Considering the trouble it's caused us both liking Gil, I agree. Huh? <gasps> You can have them all. No, you can have them. <laughs> Hi. Okay, let's put our lab coats back on. Then run! <laughs> Petting zoo. A racetrack. Wild jungle safari? This ship's got everything! Just keep hacking. The skateboard park's gotta be here somewhere. <laughs> Why are we in the Arctic Circle? We're not. We just left Pork Belly. But there's still an iceberg heading right through our ship! Don't worry. I'm sure the captain sees it and is turning right now. Oh, no. Eugene, why are you wearing the captain's uniform? As you know, I'm crazy rich. So I built a luxurious ship, then sent you a bogus sweepstakes, making you think you want a family cruise. I told you I never entered a sweepstakes, but you didn't care. It was a free cruise. Who doesn't love a free cruise? <laughs> and now that you and your family are on board, I will crash said ship into yonder iceberg. As the ship sinks, I romantically save Susan and win her heart forever. <laughs> you know, because chicks dig romantic iceberg crashing love stories. Are you nuts? Um, close. I'm in love. There is no way we're letting you crash this ship into an iceberg. Yeah, I thought you'd say that, so... I just want to go on record now and say I hate free cruises. Ditto. Enjoy my meatloaf museum and your doom. <laughs> you will be mine, Susan Tess! Read of all 
small, dorky boys. <laughs> Hello, Susan, dearest. Speaking of dorks... Oh, no! The ship has hit an iceberg! I must save you romantically. Um, what about me? Oh, right, um... taken care of. I'll save you, sweet Susan. You never entered a vacation sweepstakes, did you? Nope. nope. This whole trip was a ploy from Eugene to date our sister? Yep. You got a plan to get us out of here? Nope. Yep. Nope, that's not it. Huh? I know it's here somewhere. <laughs> Huh? I told you there was something fishy about this trip. You got something for us? You're wearing it. I'm not even gonna ask. Let's roll! Because I had a special one built, just for us. Ta-da! Butler, nice. But I'd rather sink than get in that thing with you. Seriously? Look, a deluxe lifeboat! <laughs> okay, my plan and all my passengers quickly went south. What's the plan now, Captain Idiot? Um, I am open to suggestions. We have to find the kids. We haven't visited the Meatloaf Museum yet. You're kidding, right? Yes. Hey, Mom. Hey, Dad. We have such wonderful kids. Great dog, too. Ugh. I swear, this was supposed to have a very romantic and happy ending. If we survive this, I'm gonna destroy you! <laughs> Again, not my best plan. Get to higher ground! I have an emergency airbag system that deploys with one press of a button. <laughs> this is like my worst day ever! Well, if we're going out, at least we're going out as a family. We should probably all scream now. Of the ocean? Huh, I didn't think we were gone very long. Okay, I'll just call the Coast Guard and tell them to come get us. Huh? Not so fast, Captain. Ah, you promised my family a world class vacation, and we're not leaving until we get it. Your beverages and your veggie burgers are coming up. Go! Oh. <laughs> Higher! Oh, oh. Higher! <laughs> this is the first ever meatless meatloaf served in a San Franciscan commune in the 1970s. Mm. And this slice was served at Versailles to Louis XIV. Wow. Oh, Eugene! <laughs> Ha, 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 ha!
<laughs> okay, we're here at the... I saved my allowance and gift cards, and I'd like Smash Badger 9, the revenge of whoops and a whoopsin. No dogs allowed at the store. What dog? I'm not a dog, but an hallucination in your mind. Money's in the meter and... Step on it, Dad! I gotta play! Come on! <laughs> it's time to play Smash Badger 9! I hate this game. What? You just got it! You only played for three seconds. Doggy need more info. Dookie, I'm older now, and my tastes have changed. For instance, did you know I like gourmet cheese? I did not know that. I no longer forget to zip my fly, I wash my hands without parental threats, and I need a video game that reflects my more mature tastes. Like what? I believe it was something I saw when we whooshed into the store. Store, store, store. <laughs> and causes five different syndromes, and there's one problem. You don't have the money. I trade in eight old games, plus Smash, plus my last gift card, which I was saving for a rainy day, but inside my heart it's raining. So move, dog! I want to trade in these lame games and this gift card for Toxic Battle Blast 4! Do you see the dog? Dude, there's no dog in the store now. Give me the game! Cat, Toxic Battle Blast 4 is rated M. For mom will let kids under 18 play it. No! Fillmore, come on. You've known me a long time. I spend the majority of my allowance here. So what do you say? Why don't you sell me the game? I don't say anything, you don't say anything, and we're cool. Or you don't buy anything, and I don't sell you anything. <laughs> Fainting won't work, Johnny. You're cold. Too bad, too. The game is amazing. Over a thousand different weapons, 25 violent maps, and a storyline that involves zombie combat aliens that you must destroy with only your trusty Mega Saber. Seriously, you don't see the dog? Hmm. You have to get that game! But only parents can buy the game for kids that are not 18. Then that's what I'll do. As in my busy mom who's too busy to notice her son is buying an M-rated game. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go. Come on, Jonathan. I'm very busy today. I'm on board with the acquisition, but I want to see the budgets. Thanks for driving me, Mom. Hurry up, dear. Again, Mommy's very busy. Okay, so you have the game, and you have your mom. Now what? I grab some I-rated games, as in I've outgrown them, put Toxic Battle Blast 4 in the middle. Ooh, a video game sandwich. It's genius. Your mom will never know. The extra cost will deplete your life savings. But it will be totally worth it. Wait, my savings? Did that dog just talk? You're hallucinating. You're hallucinating. hallucinating. Yes, move forward with phase three. Hey, Mom, can you uh, buy these for me while I check out the sale rack? Talk international to me. I need to buy these. And not you, uh, uh, some games for my son. It's working. She's so distracted with work and... I smell bad game for boys. Johnny! Oh, so close. That game is rated M, for it will most definitely cause nightmares and antisocial behavior. Okay, I don't get that last reference, but I want to get freaked out, and I'll only get nightmares if I can't get that game! You're old enough for some things, Johnny Test, but not M-rated games. Maybe your mom is right. Maybe you're not ready for that game. May I remind you of a thousand weapons and destroying bloodthirsty combat zombies? Now think, dog! I'm thinking! Okay, remember, 
you have to connect to his manly side by being manlyly clear. Got it. Ugh, women. Tell me about it. Thank goodness we have each other, Dad. We connect on, you know, a manly level. I'm listening. Face it, we're all numbered in this house. See? One, two, three. To two. Ignore that. We have to stick together. We're men. Manly men. Women cannot tell us what to do. Yeah, and I'll leave the toilet seat up if I want. Right. And if Mom says I can't have an M-rated video game, you can overrule her. Forget it, Johnny. To the lab. To the lab! OK, Psycho Sisters, where is it? Huh? <laughs> Take it, baby. Hip swivel. Hello, I am Robot Dad. Swingo. <laughs> Hello, Robot Dad. What do you think you're doing? I need Toxic Battle Blast 4, and I need Dad to buy it. Violent video games can cause nightmares, Johnny. And we haven't tested Robot Dad yet. Then we'd be glad to test him for you and give you an in-depth analysis of his pros and cons. <laughs> We want detailed notes on how well or how poorly Robot Dad performed. Hello! I would like to buy this video game for my, for my, for my, for my... He performed poorly. But the fire extinguisher works perfectly. Huh. I need a mustache. Yeah, I'd like to buy this game. Forget it, Johnny. Johnny? Who's Johnny? I'm... Earl. Oh. Oh. And I must say, I'm a bit surprised at your lack of ingenuity on this one. <laughs> he insulted me! Step aside, mon ami, and let a dog show you how it's done. <laughs> Yeah, I'd like to buy this game. <laughs> Cody, you're a hallucination. I stopped drinking coffee. Leave me alone. I forgot I already talked to him. Well, it's official. We're not getting that game. <laughs> it was going to be so fun and violent. Oh, there, there, nice flame-headed boy. Why are you crying? Well, I saved them my money to buy this violent video game, but it's rated M, so my parents won't let me have it because they say it'll give me nightmares and I'm too young and my name is Johnny Blah Blah Blah. That's my story, lady. Well, I'll buy the game for you. You will? Wow, what a sweet old lady who understands today's youth. I charge a $40 buyer's fee. <laughs> I mean, regular old lady who's ripping me off! You want the game or not, kid? Hmm. What? No! Well, that's all the money I have, and I'm saving it for a rainy day. <laughs> oh, look! It's raining! Did that dog just talk? He's a hallucination. <laughs> now get boy game now! Pleasure doing business with you, Johnny! because it can freak you out. Ooh, we're so scared. And let's play... Toxic Battle Blast 4! <laughs> it's more terrifying than that film I watched in health class. Uh, my eyes! They burn! But don't worry. We're man enough to handle it. And we will not get nightmares. <laughs> Zombies! Everywhere! Uh, maybe Mom and Dad were right. Maybe I'll wait until I'm mature to play M-rated games. Yeah. 